If you wanted to see a select group of information based on some different parameters, you can use filters to display different information in your table based on some selection criteria. Above the table, there are several different options. When you click filters, a pop-up appears. Let's add a simple filter first. Click add filter, and then you can use the drop-downs to set up the logic for your filter. Select the property you want to filter. We'll stick with genre here. And you can see that as I change the different options to determine the logic, it changes which rows of my table display. And so you can use a different combination of these different options to determine what does or doesn't display in your table. You can remove a filter by clicking this bin icon. Without any filters in place, you will see all of the rows and pages in your table. So let's take a look at a group filter. So you can use group filters to set up different combinations of criteria to determine what does or doesn't display in your table. So you set up each filter similarly to before by using the drop downs to choose the properties and then choosing from the available options to set up the logic for your filter. And then by using the and or options, you can have even more granular control over what does or doesn't display in your table. You can remove each filter using the bin icon and you can remove a whole group filter using this bin icon here. Next to filters, there's sort. And you can use sort to determine how your data organizes itself within the table. So if we choose title, we can choose between organizing our pages alphabetically or reverse alphabetically. We can also organize in the order of the different options that we have in a select property. So if I choose ascending by the drop down order, it will organize all of my properties within the order that I have added the different options to my select property. So if I jump in here, you can see that to read is then followed by reading is then followed by complete. And if you wanted to change this order, you can drag and drop your different options and it will reorganize the info in your table.